What would you say is the best part about your senior year? I got to take a lot of classes that I didn't even think were here at the school when I was a freshman, and I'm having a lot of fun in them, like auto tech. That class is just fun. I would say, as an exchange student, we will see what I enjoyed doing. Yeah, my well, senior year was a big doozy. Uh, I'd like to say, like maybe just the performances that I had, uh, chamber cabaret, all the choir stuff. It was just really fun being able to like meet people. Uh, from other schools, other districts, the Esvian Festival for uh, theater. It's really amazing about how all the connections I can make from just doing stuff in school, you know? As I said, I was gone for five months and I came back and my counselor just helped me a lot to be able to graduate. She was like, don't worry, I got you. And I'm like, thank you. And so I think it's gonna be so awesome that I'm actually gonna be able to work with all my friends that I had since sophomore and junior year, that I was always going to work down with them. So I think that's awesome. What will you miss about high school? The routine. Having a like scheduled, oh, this is what I need to do day in, day out. I think that's the one thing I will really miss. The one thing that I will miss about is just like the camaraderie, the friends that I'll have. I understand life is not like we'll always have friends like that in life because we all uh, disperse, we do our own things. Uh, I'll just miss that, but obviously I'll know my real friends and I'll be able to meet new people, so that's also a nice thing to know as well. I feel like it's super lenient here and I know my schedule. I have the same classes every day, I see the same people every day. I'm gonna miss that. Who was your favorite teacher or class? My favorite class was yearbook and my favorite teacher was Miss O. Um, probably Mr. Stoltz, because I spend so much time in here. I'm in Corral and Chamber, so it's two periods in here, and then I eat lunch in here because I'm kind of a choir nerd. Um, but this is just where I spend the majority of my time, and we just really get along. He's a beautiful conductor. Um, he's really good at his job, even though it's his first year here. He's made a lot of big changes. I just really appreciate the work that he does. What was your favorite teacher or class? This one was my favorite teacher. Um, she just really became a second mom to me. Every day I would talk to her, every day I would say good morning teacher, every, every day I would say goodbye teacher. Every day I would gossip with her, every day we would talk about literally the most random stuff and every day she would be there for me just like I would be there for her if she needed me. Um, she's just extremely special and important to me. What advice do you have for the future seniors of the school? Um, just, you know, enjoy your time. Like, don't really rush success. Don't really uh, make people like you. Because in the end, it's not really gonna do anything in life. Their opinions are their opinions, not your opinion on yourself. So have that respect for yourself and love for yourself to just keep doing what you love. And by the end of the day, it's that's all that really matters. Whether you work, you're nine to five, whether you work teaching children, whether you do any of those other things, whatever you love is what will ultimately matter in your life. Be aware that it's the last like, year of high school. Be aware of that so you can enjoy every moment even more. Um, go out, like not necessarily like outside of school, but like just be out of your comfort zone. Talk to all the people that you didn't talk in the entire year and just get to know them. At least even a high and like, you know, maybe you become friends after, afterwards. So I guess, yeah, get out of your comfort zone.